So you want a main in Warframe? Well, put on that ninja mask, sit down, and play We All Live Together. And we all live. And watch as I go through and see which space wizard is best for you. Obviously, it's Miku Hatsune. You might be thinking to yourself, What's a Warframe? Get the fuck off my channel, you fucking piece of shit. For all you uncultured swines who never heard about the game, I made a review about it an eternity ago. Link in the description! Before we do start, there are two things I need to mention. First, instead of the controller guide I did last time with my Overwatch video, I will instead display the stats of the Warframes on screen and go over their abilities by Passive 1, 2, 3, 4. Second, I will not be going over anything else that could be customized by the player, such as primaries, secondaries, melees, mods, sentinels, cats, dogs, zombie dogs, robot dogs, arcanes, tunnel focus, <laughs> amps, gears, arc queens and weapons, ships, railjacks, and sonic riders hoverboard ripoffs. <coughs> Let's get started. So, uh, YouTube doesn't know to really have fun. There are basically songs in here, there are four seconds long, and YouTube decides, oh, hey, that's good enough to take down this entire video. So what I'm basically gonna do is that for the next kind of songs that are copyright claim-ish, I'm gonna be saving them. So if you wanna keep your head on your shoulders, uh, I suggest you turn away now. Okay, let's get started. Our first victim, I mean subject, Excalibur. The only Warframe you should choose when starting the game. Why the fuck do I only have these two? This is fucking bullshit. His passive increases your sword speed and damage by 10%. And Excalibur Umbra has the ability to be completely self-aware. What the fuck? <laughs> no, 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 don't touch that. Don't touch that. It's breakable. Ah, fuck. No, 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 that's my No, no. <laughs> Press 1 to dash with a sword. Press 2 to blind enemies. Press 3 to shoot swords at enemies. And press 4 to make an energy sword. Saren, the perfect example of the COD community. Toxic as fuck. Her passive makes status effects longer. Press 1 to deploy spores that spread to other enemies. Press 2 to shed her skin to use as a distraction. Press 3 to apply toxic to all weapons. And press 4 to drop a poison bomb. Loki. No, not that Loki. Nope. No. That's him. His passive lets him glide and wall latch a lot longer. Like, a lot longer. A lot longer. A lot. Press 1 to deploy decoy. Press 2 to go invisible. Press 3 to swap places with an enemy. And press 4 to disarm everyone around you. Volt. The less furry version of Sonic. His passive adds extra damage to whenever he walks. Press 1 to shoot lightning. Press 2 to gain a speed boost and go fast as Sonic. And if you have strength and speed mods, you can go even faster. Clum! Press 3 to make an electric shield, and press 4 to make an electric burst. Ember. This Warframe's on fire. Her passive increases her energy and damage when she's on fire. Press 1 to throw fire. Press 2 to expose enemies to more fire damage. Press 3 to make a ring of fire, and press 4 to cause climate change. Inaros, the undying Egyptian sand boy. Tactical nuke incoming! <laughs> Egyptian. His passive lets him come back to life after dying. But only if his enemies are weaker than a fruit fly. Press 1 to throw pocket sand. Press 2 to suck up enemy life. Press 3 to go Durug Sandstorm. And press 4 to become the Sand Guardian. And the Sand Guardian, Guardian of the Sand. Poseidon quivers before him! Fuck off! Mag, she straight up sucks. Those magnets. Her passive pulls all items to her after a bullet jump. 
press 1 to pull enemies towards you. Press 2 to attract bullets on an enemy in a field. Press 3 to emit a pulse to deplete shields and armor. And press 4 to crush everyone. And now, I would like to introduce you a Warframe that I really love. Sight them up, One Punch Man, everyone. Wait a minute, didn't you make this joke last video? Yes, I fucking did, and you will watch as I do it again. Atlas, the One Punch Man of Warframe. His passive prevents knockdowns, and enemies killed while being stoned drop rocks, either healing you or adding armor. Press 1 to combo punch. Press 2 to make a rock wall. Press 3 to Medusa those motherfuckers. Did somebody say Medusa? And press 4 to summon his adoptive rock parents. Frost. Eh, I got nothing. His passive freezes enemies if they melee hit you. Press 1 to shoot ice. Press 2 to make an ice wave. Press 3 to make a snow globe. And press 4 to make an avalanche. Hydroid. Hentai at its finest. <laughs> this is so fucking bad. Why? Because we're doing it or that it looks bad? Both. His passive makes a tentacle whenever he slams that p with every slam he makes. Press 1 to make it rain. No, no. That rain, you dumbass. Press 2 to make a wicked tidal wave, man. <laughs> oh god. Press 3 to hide and make a puddle. And press 4 to make a kraken. Gara, just like glass, breakable. Her passive blinds enemies when she's in light. Press 1 to either stab or slash with glass. Press 2 to make a glass shield. Press 3 to make glass mirrors. And press 4 to make a wall of glass. Chroma. Ew. Wait, that's not Chroma. Hold on, just give me one second. Alright, just like that. Ah, that's better. Chroma, the ultimate battle dragon, and is my personal favorite just because I get to do this. The defeat was merely a delay. To the time after Oblivion opened. When the sons of Skyrim would spill their own blood. No one wanted to believe. Believe they even existed. And when the truth finally dawns, it dawns in fire. But there's one they fear. In their tongue, he is Dovakin, Dragonborn. Passive changes his element's abilities based on his energy color. White for ice, blue for electricity, red for fire, and green for poison. Press 1 to puke on enemies. <laughs> Press 2 to add a boost to you and your allies. Fire for health, electricity for shields, ice for armor, and poison for speed. Press 3 to gain armor on shield lost, and a damage boost on health lost. And press 4 to deploy your skin that will puke on others. <laughs> Bobbin. He's okay, I guess. Wait, I haven't seen his skin before. Hey, it's Alphonse from Full Metal Alchemist. His passive increases armor by 20% with every allies in game. That's if you have friends. So, uh, his passive has changed since I wrote the script. Um, it is now that enemies who are, uh, hold down will basically gain, uh, 20% more damage, uh, received. Hmm. Well, too late to change it now. Press 1 to throw an electricity ball. Press 2 to lay down trap mines. Press 3 to hold enemies in the area. And press 4 to make a black hole.
Huh? Where am I? A am I dead? What's going on? Who's there? Anyone there? Who... Who are you? John C- <laughs> Rhino. Strong, but dumb. Rhino. I'm gonna take a wild guess that you're strong, but dumb. I've been dying to see what you can do. Let's go. Ah, just try to break through my armor. I'm gonna break your bones and make you cry for your mama. His passive makes a shockwave after a long fall. Press 1 to charge. Press 2 to make armor to protect yourself. Press 3 to increase you and your team's damage. And press 4 to stomp so hard it breaks physics. And your game. Limbo, aka Dio from JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. His passive lets him cross into the rift by pressing roll. Press 1 to bring allies or enemies into the rift. Press 2 to yell. Press 3 to search enemies and bring more into the rift. And press 4 to make a rift bubble. Garuda. AKA Tokyo Ghoul. She has two passives. First one increases her damage with less health, and her second are talons used as a melee weapon if no other melee is equipped. Press 1 to jump on a mofo and use his blood as a shield. And press 1 again to release all the damage built up. Press 2 to use an enemy as a life support fountain. Press 3 to cut your health in half to gain energy. And press 4 to go full on emo. Banshee, the Warframe nobody likes. <coughs> Step <Cephalon shy. coughs> Her passive silence her weapons. Press 1 to make a sound wave. Press 2 to expose critical hit points. Press 3 to stun enemies and silence all sounds. And press 4 to blast the fucking speakers. We interrupt this program for a quick Q&A. First question, have you ever noticed that Symmetra's Oasis skin looks like the Lotus? Yes. Yes, it fucking does. Tenno, it's the Grenier. It's been a Grenier the entire fucking mission! And now, back to our regularly scheduled program. Nidus, aka Carnage from the Spider-Man series. Cassidy is gone. There is only Carnage! Hmm, what would it look like if I had this deluxe skin? Oh. God. His passive is Mutant Stacks. If his health dropped to zero and he has at least 15 out of 100 stacks, he gains half his health back and gains 5 seconds of invulnerability. Basically the Super Saiyan meme. <coughs> Press 1 to make an infested wave. Press 2 to gather enemies together. Press 3 to link yourself to enemies or allies. And press 4 to make a healing garden. Ash. The anime weave. His passive increases the duration and damage of slash damage. Press 1 to throw shurikens. Press 2 to throw a smoke screen. Press 3 to teleport to an enemy. And press 4 to go full blown Naruto. Nova. She's cool, I guess. Her passive makes a shockwave whenever she's knocked down. Press 1 to make Nova an element. Press 2 to make a portal. Press 3 to make a science bomb. And press 4 to break reality. Slide to the left. Slide to the right. Crisscross. And your computer, Baruch, the monk that enjoys burn. His passive is Restraint. When he uses his first three abilities, his Restraint weakens. This gives him damage resistance and can be used for his final ability. Press 1 to avoid attacks in a direction. Press 2 to put enemies to sleep. Press 3 to make floating daggers to block damage or disarm enemies. And press 4 to go full on Iron Fist. Nyx, the Mind Control Frame. Her passive sucks ass. Press 1 to Mind Control. Press 2 to throw psychic bolts. Press 3 to make everyone betray each other. And press 4 to not die. Mesa, the gender swap inspiration of McCree. And by inspiration, I meant completely ripped off.
passive reloads single secondaries faster and fires dual secondaries faster. And if no melee weapon is equipped, she gains extra health. Press 1 to charge up damage and press it again to release it into the next shot. Press 2 to stun enemies, press 3 to reduce damage, and press 4 to KILL EVERYTHING! It's high noon. Ah, oh, shit. Hero, keep this piece away from children. Heh <laughs> Oh god, I'm gonna get in trouble for this. His passive doubles his overshield capability. Press 1 to freeze enemies and gain shields. Press 2 to sacrifice shield for attack speed, fire rate, and healing. Press 3 to sacrifice energy to gain more energy on each kill. And press 4 to take all incoming damage to increase critical chance. Hildren, the mixture of Zarya from Overwatch and Moto Moto. Look out, I think Moto Moto likes you. <laughs> Here he comes. Who's your friends? Or is that your butt? The fuck you say to me, you little shit! Fire his will! Hildren has no energy and uses shields to activate her abilities. Her passive makes her invincible for 5 seconds when her shields are out. Press 1 to shoot rockets from your hands. Press 2 to deplete enemy shields and armor to restore your shields. Press 3 to give allies extra shields and bestow her passive onto others while damaging enemies. And press 4 to play a better version of Anthem. Oh yeah, fuck Anthem! Deoxys. Whoops! There we go. Equinox, the transgender Warframe. Her passive gives her energy when picking up health orbs, and health when picking up energy orbs. Press 1 to change it to night or day form. Both forms can perform the next three abilities differently. Press 2 to put enemies asleep in night form, and faster but weaker in day form. Press 3 to reduce damage from enemies in night form, and increase allies' ability strength in day form. And press 4 to heal allies with every enemy death in night form, and bleed nearby enemies in day form. Trinity, the better version- hey, hey. Trinity, the better version of Mercy. Press 1 to make enemies into health pools. Press 2 to make enemies into energy pool. Press 3 to link damage received to nearby enemies. And press 4 to restore health and shields and make everyone immune to damage. Revenant. Based off the famous vampire, Vladimir Putin. His passive knocks down enemies when his shields run out. Press 1 to mind control. Press 2 to make a shield and stun anyone who hits you. Press 3 to turn into smoke and suck enemy life. And press 4 to go, watch out, here I come. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Like a record, baby, right round, round, round. You spin me right round, baby, right round. Like a record, baby, right round, round, round. You spin me right round, baby, right round, like a record, baby, right round, I want round, your round. love. Wukong, the monkey frame. No, not that one. No, no. There we go. Wukong, the monkey frame. His passive increases melee combo duration. Press 1 to poke enemies with a stick. Oh, wait, hang on. I'm getting a call. Yeah? Uh-huh. Oh, really? Oh. Oh, okay. No, 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 that's fine. I mean, I'm just already... No, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay. So, uh... I've been informed he has a rework. And, uh... Well, shit. Some of these abilities I mentioned might change. Press 2 to turn into a puff of smoke. Press 3 to use energy gaining health after reaching 0. And press 4 to carry a giant stick and beat the living shit out of everyone. Nezha. A.K.A. Miku Hatsune. Oh, God damn it, I just got that thought out of my head. His passive has longer slides. Press 1 to make fire from your feet. Press 2 to throw his ring. And press it again to teleport to it. Press 3 to make a ring of fire around him. And press 4 to put fire spears into your enemies. Valkyr. The Warframe with the most complex design. Oh, God.
hard. Her passive recovers from knockdowns faster. Press 1 to swing like Spider-Man. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, does whatever a spider can. Or to swing around enemies. Press 2 to increase melee speed and armor, while decreasing enemy speed. Press 3 to knock back enemies. And press 4 to become an unstoppable MLG dink meme. I'm on my period! Now you fucked up! Easy! We interrupt this program again to bring you a word from our sponsor. Hey, I know! I'll use my trusty frying pan as a drying pan! Brock's frying pan, so you can fry and stay dry. Order now! Eh? Huh? Eh? Huh? What do you think? FUCKING GENIUS! And now back to our regularly scheduled program. Necros, the undead ninja boy. And it's my second personal favorite. Just because I get to do this. Give up, Skeletor. You're finished. Curse you, He-Man! You interfering imbecile! Give us one good reason we shouldn't vanquish you to another dimension. Okay, guys, hear me out. Switching to Geico could save you... hundreds on car insurance? Huh, he does make a point. Yes. I do like to save money. Catch you on the flip, suckers! <laughs> Geico, because saving 15% or more on car insurance is always a great answer. His passive gains 5 HP for every death within 5 meters. Press 1 to punch souls. No, not that soul, you dumbass! Press 2 to turn bodies into resources. Press 3 to scare away enemies. And press 4 to make an army of the dead. Korra, the sexy cat woman with the biggest ass. God damn it! Her passive is Veneri, a cat that can be modded out just like a companion without taking up your companion space. You know what that means. Double kitten power! That's a lot of damage. I need healing. Heroes never. Oh! You are a fucking piece of shit. Thank you. For good night, forever. I'm good. Get fucked. One to whip it. No! 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 Press two to entangle enemies together. Press three to switch Venary's three modes: bad, bad, and healing. And press four to strangle your enemies on a children's playground. Ah, BDSM. Isn't it lovely? <laughs> Titania. Tinkerbell's badass cousin. Her passive makes her bullet jump leave a pool to make allies' bullet jumps more powerful. Press 1 to make enemies float and unarmed. Press 2 to weaken enemies and receive a random ability buff. Press 3 to make enemies into a lantern gathering nearby enemies. And press 4 to become a majestic, magical murderer. Zephyr, the bird. That, that's it. Just a bird. I'm like a bird, I only fly away. Her passive makes her fall slower. Press 1 to fly in any direction. Press 2 to make an air grenade. Press 3 to avoid bullets. And press 4 to make a tornado. And press 4 near the ocean to recreate Sharknado. Oberon, the sassy goat. Zapatero, ¿qué opina usted del gobierno de Zapatero? <laughs> His passive increases pet armor, health, and shields, along with one instant revive permission. Press 1 to do... Whatever the hell that was. Press 2 to make radiation grass. Press 3 to heal. And press 4 to make everyone do the flop. Everybody do the flop! <laughs> Ivaria, aka Mushroom Head. It's a giant mushroom. Maybe it's friendly! Her passive detects enemies on the radar. Press 1 to use 4 different arrows. Invisibility, dash wire, noise, and sleep. Press 2 to fully navigate her arrows and projectiles.
Wait, that's not Avaria. Much better. Down there! Press 3 to go invisible and steal enemy shit, and press 4 to summon a bow with way too much multi-shot. Mirage, the one woman game bane. Her passive lets her slide and do... that. Faster. Press 1 to make 4 copies of her. Press 2 to make items and lockers traps. Press 3 to do more damage in light, and take less damage in dark. And press 4 to make a disco fever. And last but most certainly least, Octavia. The music Warframe. You've got mail. Oh hey, Brandon sent me a music link. And done. Now just gonna play. Oh, God damn it! Octavia has two passives. One is her regeneration ability. Regenerates energy for every ability used. And the Manda Chord. An arm device that can play music based on the instruments and nods placed that can affect her abilities. Which should sound like this. But actually sounds like this. <laughs> Press 1 to make a distracting ball. Press 2 to make a distracting ball. Press 3 to make distracting floor patterns that's more frustrating than Dance Dance Revolution. What the fuck is going on? And press 4 to boost your attacks with sound. Louder. Louder. Louder! Louder! Oh, really? <laughs> Thank you for watching. Now, if you excuse me, I'm going to masturbate to Lotus Po- Hey, kiddo. Nope, 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 nope. You me right now, baby, right now. Invisible in the air, and swift on the ground, she moves like the wind. This is Wisp. Ah, fuck. I, I, I need to do this one? I have to? Okay, fine. Wisp. The ghost frame. Ooh. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Her passive makes her invisible while in the air. Press 1 to place three types of pods. Health, speed, and CC. Press 2 to make a copy of herself for distraction, and press it again to teleport to it. Press 3 to blind enemies, and when killed, send small projectiles. And press 4 to praise the sun! Alright, no more. I am not working on anyone else.
a new Warframe. So this is the Runner Warframe. <laughs> Ignore the drone. God fucking damn it!